It claimed to be the first passenger railway in the world, and its fame spread far beyond its own range, Swansea to Oystermouth. People were making the most of the trip just before it closed down after long and faithful service. Sad to think of the end of a railway with such a history. Old pictures of the Mumbles train recall its great adaptability to progress through the years. First, an example of its early horse-drawn period over 150 years ago. Attractive, isn't it? Next, a carriage of 1865. Looks tough on the horse, but there's room for more people. Steam had taken over some 12 years later, a tremendous leap forward, but not the last. At the end, the railway was electrified, and it looked like a train of trams or trolleybuses. It could carry 1,270 seated passengers an hour, but it's all for the scrap heap.